Hi, I'm Sylvia Getman, President and CEO of Adirondack Health. If you look out any window at the Adirondack Medical Center, you quickly realize the Adirondacks are no ordinary place to live. So it is no wonder that the staff and physicians that care for communities across nearly 100 miles of this rugged, beautiful landscape are no ordinary caregivers. They are highly trained professionals with an informed perspective on how to provide the very best care for the 130,000 year-round residents, 200,000 seasonal residents, and nearly 10 million visitors who live, work, and play here. Today I am here to thank you for your generous support and investment in this remarkable organization, Adirondack Health. We consist of a hospital, a nursing home, two emergency rooms, three sports medicine and rehab facilities, four health centers, a whole host of surgical, bariatric, medical, and dental services, and so much more. And most notably, 793 highly trained, compassionate caregivers that are so, so far north of ordinary. And it's on their behalf that I thank you for investing in the work that we're doing and literally helping us break ground and build the future of healthcare here in the Adirondacks. All right, let's get this project going. The history of these ORs, they were built in the very early 60s. I was built in 1967, so these ORs are older than I am. Hi, I'm Dr. Michael Hill. I've been uh, here since 2001. I'm the Chief of Surgery, and we're here at Adirondack Health and very excited about the new OR projects, and uh, we're going to go on inside and, and take a look around. The future plans are very, very exciting. The future ORs are going to be all interchangeable in that. No matter what surgeon or type of surgery needs to be done, all the rooms are equipped the same way so that those surgeries can take place in those rooms. The new surgical center is going to create a lot of patient advantages. When people come out of training these days, they want to come to a system that is organized and new and has all the advances that they've been just trained on. Uh, this allows us to maintain the ability to attract the best and the brightest and to maintain a viability in the surgical uh, system, so to speak. Hi, I'm Dr. William Smith, an orthopedic surgeon at Lake Placid Sports Medicine. Excited to introduce you to our project, Lake Placid Sports Medicine and Fitness. This is an expansion of our current services, but it will incorporate not just the medical practices, but a new and more exciting element that is fitness for the community and the region. So in the future, we'd like to build out a bigger space that incorporates not only the care of athletes, but the care of the community at large and expanding into fitness really makes a lot of sense. If there was a drug that helped prevent diabetes, heart disease, and cancer and had almost no side effects if administered properly, everyone would say, we want that. And that thing is exercise. Hi, I'm Scott McGraw. The Future of Care campaign is a personal one for me, and I'm happy to be involved in it. If you look at our facilities, both in Lake Placid and Saranac Lake, there's a need. There is a need, but there's also a vision. There's a need to improve those facilities, but also a vision to move forward with healthcare in our region. And now it's our turn to step forward. Please give generously to the Future of Care campaign. The future of healthcare in our region depends on all of us. It's all of our responsibility. Thank you.